Hi. The last week of my video is for 2020. And I thought I'd wrap up by talking about um, a key project that I've been working on this year. I won't mention the organisation. It's a large organisation who are doing a significant upgrade to a software platform and still are. It will go live early next year. And I got engaged back in January and had one meeting um, with the what you probably call the project sponsor. And then COVID. So the whole project has been delivered, the whole organisational change management aspect of the project and the other aspects have been delivered virtually and will continue to do so. And may I say, even though we haven't gone live yet, the feedback has been a resounding success. People saying things like, I've been in this organisation for X years and I've never known or ever felt so involved, so informed in a change initiative as I have now. And that's great. And um, yeah, so how do we do it? How do we go virtual and have such a resounding success? Well, one of the things I think we should do is keep go, go back to basics. We get, there are so many methodologies and approaches out there and it's a minefield. And just go back to some fundamentals. What do people need to know? They need to know why we're making the change. When we forget to tell people why, that's when we get the resistance. When we tell them why and what's in it for them, we mitigate that resistance. We eradicate it in many, in many situations. If I said to you, the platform we're currently using is no longer supported, we will no longer get updates. If it breaks, no one's going to be there to fix it. And we'll also get some brilliant up-to-date features and enhancements and, you know, all those things that you struggle to do in this one, we can now do in this one. And that's why we're doing it. I'm going to say, tell me where I sign. I'm on board. Um, you know, in most, there's always exceptions, but if we explain why, as the first cab off the rank, you've got most of the people on board. Talk to you tomorrow.